YouTube, what's going on, baby? It's your boy Scales, and we back at it again. But today, we back for a big one, a big one, the biggest ones, the biggest of the baddest ones, ladies and gentlemen. It's time for us to talk about the biggest card in the game, the 99 rated, the one, the only. First of all, how, 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 how come when my girlfriend asks y'all for thumbs up, y'all be doing crazy amount of thumbs up? But when your boy hits you for asking for a thumbs up, it's kind of a lot of thumbs up, but like it's not like as many as my girl. All right, wait, that made me sound ungrateful. I'm not ungrateful. Y'all, I love you guys. Everybody who hits thumbs up for me, yo, you guys are the absolute legends. I appreciate you guys so much. But it's something about when my girl's like, hey, can you hit a thumbs up? All y'all break that thing, bro. Hey, real quick for your boy, because you hit that big old thumbs up. Ladies and gentlemen, today we got the foot champions. It opens in seven minutes, and we're going to jump into the foot champions. But we're not just going to jump into the foot champions, ladies and gentlemen we got him 99 rated belito the brazilian beast if you watched me back in fifa 20 you know that this man 30 and owed for me it was him at middle cam it was it was salito on the right and i believe it was in Bapito on the left something like that but your boy used middle cam Pele and we 30 and 0 with him. Now it wasn't the moments one, but ladies and gentlemen, for 11.4 million coins, we bring in the 90 rated Pele with 36 games played, 56 goals, and 27 assists. We have played a bunch of games with him already. I'm excited to try the weekend league with this absolute stud, and I'm so happy that we finally got this card to be able to showcase him on the channel. So, ladies and gentlemen, it's not just 99 rated Pele, but ladies and gentlemen, it's Pele, it's foot champs with the highest rated card in the game. And we are about to absolute hopefully beast and feast because if i don't then i'm absolutely trash the team is looking juicy and we're not done yet ladies and gentlemen upgrades have happened cristiano ronaldo pelito and papito uh the boy asala uh, uh, sala messi the boy uh uh holy moments Vieira. we got varan moments rio we got jo uh, joan felix uh, uh joan joan cancelo not felix excuse me van der sar and the one the only big boy mendy now ladies and gentlemen the super sauce for this one is going to be the one the only david who has just recently been upgraded we're also going to bring the home boy himself a race and we're also gonna bring my boy Renato Sanchez ladies and gentlemen this is the squad that's gonna battle it for us in today's episode but we will be making more changes to the squad as the weekend league goes on your boy's gonna do the best to try to get that top 100 hey for the positivity man can you hit that big old thumbs up for your boy hit that thumbs up for your boy right now bro to see if we can finally drop that big 30 and 0 finally get that 50th in the world that number one in the whatever dude hit that big old thumbs up in the comments down below in the comments down below I need you to be 100% honest with me I let you, I want you to let me know what would you do with this team if you had 99 rated Pele, team of the year Cristiano Ronaldo, and a big boy Messi. What would you do in the weekend league? Would you 30 and 0? Would you 25 and 5? Would you 26 and 4? Would you 18 and whatever? What would your record be in the weekend league if you played with this exact squad that I have on your screen right now? Hey, bro, because I like to be realistic with everybody, and with this team, it looks like I would drop a 30 and 0 for sure. But man, don't know if he's actually gonna finally be able to do it. I'm gonna be in a different, a couple different formations. I'm gonna be in the 4-2-3-1, the 4-3-1-2 if I need it. And the 442. Mostly the 442 and the 4231. The 442 is going to see Pele at the striker with Cristiano Ronaldo. Pele at CR7 at the strikers and Bappe and Messi on the wings with Hullet and Vieira down the middle with the boys Juan Cancelo, Mendy, Rio, and Varan in the back. Now, when I'm in the middle cam position with the 4231, that's when Pele drops behind Cristiano Ronaldo. Remember, all these stats have been done with big boy Pele behind Ronaldo or but aside Ronaldo. This card has been absolutely terrorizing uh, FIFA Force and we absolutely love his card, but we need to make sure that we dominate in the weekend league with them. We need Pele to show up in the weekend league. It's the most important mode in the game right now for us. So we really need this card to show up, shine, and beast and feast. Ladies and gentlemen, it's foot champions with the highest rated card. 99 rated Pele. All right, baby. Ooh. Yes, indeedy. Don't be greedy. It's go time, baby. It is go time in game one of the weekend league. And this dude's team was looking kind of juicy, baby. This dude's team looks like it could really get it done. And we have a very tough game on our hands. I saw a few icons in there. I saw a name out of Zito. I saw a solid squad, baby. So we're going to see what 99 rated Pele and team of the year Ronaldo can do for us, man. Weekend league. You guys know I'm not at my usual setup. What's this guy doing, bro? Oh, I thought he's about to give us a free win. I, I got excited, but they're not. Ain't nothing free in life. You know what I'm saying, my boys? Pele is already on the run, and Pele can do it, and he does. Literally seconds into the video, not into the game, but also into the video, bro. And my boy Pele hits the first goal of the game, the first goal of the weekend league as well, and the first goal on this channel. Ladies and gentlemen, it only took three minutes for 99 rated Pele to hit the back of the net that quickly, that sexy, that amazing. Here we go, baby. That feels good, man. It feels good. And I'm going to be honest with you because I know a lot of you guys are... Oh, baby, hold on. 
Hold on. Yeah. I know a lot of you guys are going to ask the question, right? So let's get out the way right now, bro. Let's go ahead and get it out the way because it's going to be a question everybody's going to talk about. Yo, is Pele better than R9? Um, So the thing about it is, right? No cap. My boy Pelé scores more goals. I ain't capping. I'm telling you the truth. My boy Pelé scores more goals. I think I got more goals with this 99 Pelé than I that had with uh, uh, Moments R9. So I don't know who's better. I'm just saying I think I have more goals with him in less games. We're moving. We're moving. We're moving. We're moving. Here's Pelé. Back to Mbappe. Oh, baby. You know what's crazy, though? This gameplay feels terrible. This gameplay feels so heavy. Cristiano! Cristiano Ronaldo. He wants, he wants to show up to the Pele party, baby. Now, 11 minutes into the game, Cristiano got one. Pele got two. That's three nil for the boys. 11 minutes in, we are showing up and we are playing some footy, baby. Very nicely done by the big squad, man. Well done. Well put in. And hopefully, Pele can just score more goals. So, so here's the thing, right? All those stats you saw on my Pele come in Division One, so that's why I think Pele. When when you ask me the question, which one is better between R9 and Pele? It's gonna be interesting, right? Because Pele had weekend leagues under his belt. Now, when you play Division One, it's always in a certain skill rating, right? So I'm at 2,000, like 300, 2,400 skill rating. So when I match people, it's gonna be always above pretty much 2,000. So Pele has done that damage within players that are pretty solid at the game when you go into the weekend league you can get anything right it, it, it all depends on you know it, who you get matched up against when you get matched up it's more random so what i'm trying to say is pele has done it probably against harder opponents as well and his stats are still even better so oh man it's a juicy conversation but is, is 99 pele better than moments r9 bro what a conversation that is huh Big boy Pele. I'm just feel blessed I was able to play with both of them, man. Hey, thank you guys so much for making this happen for me, man. To be able to play with both these cards is just so sick. Let me get this up to my boy Pele. He waits for a minute. He looks up, finds Mbappe. Mbappe could probably swing it back towards. I honestly wanted Pele right there, but Cristiano Ronaldo is having a field day in the air, man. So we'll make it 4-0 very early on. 19 minutes into this game, we're up 4-0. And my opponent looks like he's thinking about maybe pulling the trigger and just backing out. But he's staying. He's staying, my boy. He is staying. He is staying. He is staying. He is staying. 4-0, 20 minutes into the game. Pele with two, Cristiano with two. It is a deadly squad, and hopefully the servers are just good enough for where I'm at, and I can able to just play the play all 30 games and get an okay finish. Rio's chilling with it. Are we getting a hat trick for my boy Pele? Oh, it's about to happen. And there it is. Yo, I literally said it, and as I said it, it happened. 24 minutes into the game, the Brazilian man himself, big boy Pele, throw rocking a six on his back. I probably should change that. But Pele hits the back of the net. Big boy Holy comes to give him a hug. What a beautiful finish for my boy Pele, man. You love to see it. 99 rated card. The only 99 in the game right now, right? I'm pretty sure he's the only 99 in the game. Uh, did Ronaldo and them get 99s? They didn't, right? I don't think they did. Am I tripping or did they get 99s? I don't think they did. I'm going to keep it 100% with you. My opponent hit the back of the net. I don't know how, but he did. I don't know if it was a kickoff or what the heck it was, but he was able to break through and hit the back of the net. Easy peasy for him. Pele dancing. I almost cooked Smaldini right there, bro. We almost made it happen. Here comes my opponent once again. Maybe we should just start playing better defense. The fact that I gave him a goal actually kind of upsets me. We should just play good defense, not sell for a lot of goals. And, uh, you know, get out of here with a very, very comfortable, comfortable first game. But instead, I decided to go ahead and suffer a goal like a dummy. All right, man. So we're now in the 4-2-3-1. And here comes Pele. Skill move, Pele. Ah, unlucky, bro. I messed up. Yeah, I'm in the 4-2-3-1, which will now see Pele go ahead and switch the cam position. I kind of want two, two CDMs a little bit deeper just so we see this game out. I don't think this game's in any type, way, shape, or form in any trouble. But, but since he hit the back of the net... Let's just play it safe. Let's make sure we don't suffer no more goals here. Here's a tile dancing. We steal that one with Hullet. Right before halftime, could we find the back of the net one last time? I could as well. Pele is turning on the Jets. Does the keeper come out? The answer is yes. And Pele finesses. And ladies and gentlemen, it is 6-1 before the halftime whistle blew. A nice through pass from Cristiano straight over to the boy Pelito. And that's going to send us right to halftime, man. Hey, come on, man. Come on, ref. Blow the whistle. There it is, man. Hey, y'all, since my opponent won't back out, I got a real comfortable lead, right? So I'm going into a 4-3-1-2, and I'm just going to try to score a crazy amount of goals. He doesn't really want to back out this thing. I'm going to go absolute full send, bro. I think we're pretty comfortable. I don't think he's going to be able to put up five goals on us. So with that being said, let's get into an attacking formation, and let's just go full send, man. Let's try to get as many goals as possible with this boy Pele and Cristiano Ronaldo. I try to pop that one up. Maybe I should have taken the shot there. I'm not even sure. Look at Pele playing the cam position, and what a ball to my boy Cristiano. What a ball, what a ball. The skill move happens. Cristiano, bang! Ah, 
What a goal for Cristiano Ronaldo. I believe it's a hat trick for Pelé and a hat trick for Cristiano. I think that's what took place in this game, but I know it's Pelé with another assist. So, ladies and gentlemen, Pelé played middle cam on two different formations in this game, and he also played striker in one formation in this game. So, as you guys can see, Pelé is very, very good in multiple, multiple formations. He's just able to do it all, man. Quick dribbling, got the good passing, got the skill moves, got everything you need. And to be honest with you, oh, wow. To be 100% honest with you, I'm going to keep it 100 with you guys. This gameplay I'm playing right now is horrendous, bro. It is super, super, super heavy. And the fact that we were able to do this in really heavy gameplay is crazy. Here comes Pele one more time. The ball roll. That was supposed to be a ball roll. You see what I'm saying? Heavy gameplay, bro. That was supposed to be a ball roll. Here's Pele. He turns the Jets on, gets through, shoots, bangs. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, does the man actually miss? Does he? Nah, I've seen him miss. I'm lying. Don't listen. Listen, he misses. Don't don't play. Yo, he misses and he misses a lot, bro. He misses just like any other card in FIFA, bro. Sometimes he misses something. I'm just like, yo, he's 99 rated. How did that just happen? But hey, sometimes it happens, man. But then he does all the things like this game and you're like, sheesh, what a card. Look at my boy Pele go to work there. Unlucky not to get by that last guy. If he did, would have been another one. But he's assisted. He scored. I think I played him offside. Maybe not, bro. Who I didn't do if Understar got cooked. Ladies and gentlemen, 8-2. Oh, no, the memes. The memes in the comments. Oh, no, the 8-2 meme. Here we go again, buddy. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we've done it, man. We go ahead and we win this game with big boy Pele. I had to let him score again, man. I couldn't have the 8-2 memes in the comments. It's 8-3 how this one ends. Big boy Pele picked up five goals on nine shots. Cristiano Ronaldo also picked up three goals. That's five, six, seven. Seven goals came from just them, man. Actually, eight goals, right? Five, six, seven, eight. Come on, man. Can you count? Eight goals came from just them. Um, and then the assists came from one from Pele, three from Ronaldo, two from Mbappito, and one from Messi. So, ladies and gentlemen, the first game of the weekend league is in the bag. It's done. It's dusted. We beasted. We feasted. We picked up a huge win, and Pele picked himself up five more goals to go against this tally. Unbelievable. Let's see what game two has to offer us. A foot champs, baby. Game number two. It's an all gold. No chemistry. Oh, okay. All right, well, let's just hope for clean gameplay. The last gameplay was real sus. Let's hope for some clean, clean gameplay. He got a Liverpool back line with a random uh, Cordrado. I don't know what that, and a random Neuer. Okay, my man probably just started playing the uh, FIFA. The fact that you have this team and you just started playing FIFA, that's pretty impressive, bro. That is, I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry we had to match, but I got to go full send here, puppy. Boy, Cristiano, I'm going to Messi. Messi with a big opening. Big boy Messi stops for a second, looks up, finds Hullet, back into Cristiano! Boom! I know it's the 99 rated Pelé episode, right? But yes, listen, 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 ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, weekend league, there is no there is no one card, okay? We'll see what he can do throughout the weekend league. But man, if we, ain't, we ain't out here feeding him. We need to get goals. We need to win games. It ain't nothing else but winning games. Big boy Hullet has a chance here. I mean, uh, Pelé has a chance. How does he not burn Gomez right there? I know Gomez is quick, quick, but like... Shouldn't we just be smacking him right there? Nice pass to Cristiano. Back into Hullet. I'm going to cut down like this. Hit the finesse like that. And then boom. Did I keep calling Pelé Hullet, bro? Stop calling him Hullet. That was Pelé, bro. Nice cut inside. Nice finesse. Nice goal. Bang. 2-0. Big boy Pelé hits the back of the net. Lovely goal if you ask me. And that could be a rage quit, bro. That could see us being 2-0 in the weekend league. Maybe. Bang, there it is. So there it is, man. In two games, we got six goals from Hullet. Obviously, this guy backed out quick. Otherwise, so, but did I say Hullet again, bro? <laughs> Yo, Pele, bro. Pele with another one. Yo, and all I got to say is, like, if this dude stayed, Pele would have had way more goals. That's 2-0 in the weekend league. Let's move. Game three. Boom. This guy has a sexy team. That's a solid team, bro. Nice back line. Two good CDMs. Cristiano Ronaldo up top. 4-2-3-1. The chemistry is off, but that's okay, baby. Game number three. Let's see what we do. No way. No way, dude. No way that just happened, bro. No way that just... Oh, my goodness. This video game, dude. This video game, dude. I can't believe my eyes, man. Royce? Come on, Royce! Come on, Royce! Let's go! Big boy Royce. Back of the net. Come on, yo. We got to keep going, though. We can't go to pens with this guy. We can't go to pens with this guy. Come on now. Keep going, baby. Keep going. Can we get a win back? Nice. All the way down. Hold it. First time shot. Bang! Come on! Let's go, dude. Huge comeback, bro. Huge comeback. Yo, we needed that so bad, bros. 
Yo, come on. The dude literally sat back and did absolutely nothing. The last couple minutes of the game, I had to pull out uh, Pele. He was completely exhausted. So I pulled him out. Big boy Royce with a game-saving goal. And the boy Hole with an unbelievable finish as well. And that's going to see us get past this dude who just did not want to play FIFA, man. As you guys can see, he legitimately kept the ball away from me the entire game bro he just kept passing and you can see where his possession comes it's behind his half bro he legitimately did not want to play the game bro he did not want to play the game at all all he did was pass around the back had one cross whipped in almost took it from us but luckily bro we were able to find the back of the net twice in the second half of extra time and that's gonna see us get the three and zero i am chilling on weekend league for the rest bro i'm chilling for right now bro we'll jump into more later that gameplay was extremely heavy but your boy Pelé has gone off once again now 39 games played with 62 goals and 29 assists boy nation i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did smash that thumbs up subscribe turn your bell on let me know who you want me to bring into the ch into the channel next what player you want to see thank you all for watching i love your faces and i will catch you back here tomorrow oh yeah